Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Rune Stone. We're doing Let's Talk Legendary. Today we'll be talking about Sibylin, the Sea and Sky. So Sibylin is actually a merfolk god on the plane of Dalmanera. She is actually the patron to the merfolk from the Empire of Voldalia. One of the rules of the Sibylians is that no mortal can go near the divine. It is said that Sibylin is not communicated with her father since she formed the merfolk. Her words are actually recorded in ancient writings, which are the folks of the followers. The symbol of the wind moon is actually the symbol of the civilian. When the mist moon is in its full phase, which is actually roughly 28 days, the followers need to spend the night in contemplation. There is actually a society known as the Society of the Conch, which actually go around the world trying to figure out and understand how a civilian interacts with other cultures. And this is currently all the information we have her at the time. So civilian of the sea and sky is represented in one card, which this one is from Modern Horizons 2. It's a legendary creature, merfolk god obviously, has indestructible zone and control at least two other merfolk. Whenever she attacks, draw a card. Other merfolk you control have ward one. So that's really, really cool for one colorless and two islands for a three four. So for three four, that's basically you pay that's just in itself is really cool. So she's actually associated with two cards, this one from being fallen empires. And it's about the priest. It says, target creature may not be the target of spells or abilities. It's on turn uses only during your upkeep. But it says, early Valdalians worship Sylvanian, goddess of the pearl moon. Later, she became more abstract figure. And the other card she's actually just simply associated with, which is fallen, fallen empires as well, is its temple, the picture. And it has no any other things about it. It just says, sacrifice it, add two blue mana to your mana pool, or tap it to add one blue. That is it. And last but not least, she is referred to in the High Tide card from Fallen Empires as well. And it says, May Sylvanian and her tides favor you. And that's supposed to be a picture of that representer. And if you like this video, there's more on this channel. I hope you guys have a good day and a good evening.